guys, the time has finally come. The trailer for Denis Villeneuve's Dune has now just dropped online, I think about an hour ago or less than an hour ago, I'm not quite sure. But it's finally here, but huge disclaimer, when I went to go see Tenet, they did play a trailer for Dune before that, so... Um, but that was probably just a teaser because this trailer I'm looking is three minutes long and I don't think the trailer that I watched in Tenet was that long. So, um, I think there's going to be a bunch of stuff in here that I haven't seen before. Um, at least I hope, but, um, we all know how excited I am for this film as, as honestly, everybody else that I know is super excited for this film because Denis Villeneuve is an incredible director. He's probably my top three favorite modern directors that we have and um obviously the dune name has a lot of hype and a lot of a lot of excitement because of honestly for a lot of different reasons um it was a great book that a lot of people really really loved and um through all of its hype back in the 70s with hodorowski and all just the massive vision that he had for it but it was unfortunately not able to come to life because Hollywood sucks. Um, It just didn't happen. So, all right, I'm going to stop talking because I'm really, really excited, if you can't tell, to watch this trailer. So let's just dive right into it. There's something happening to me. There's something awakening in my mind. I can't control it. What did you see? There's a crusade coming. Yeah, this is a lot different than what I saw. You often dream things that happen just as you dream them. Yes. The test is simple. Remove your hand from the box and you die. What's in the box? Pain. You inherit too much power. You have proven you can rule yourself. Now you must learn to rule others. Something none of your ancestors learned. My father rules an entire planet. He's losing it. He's getting a richer one. He'll lose that one too. Arrakis is a death trap. This is an extermination. I love that Pink Floyd take in the they background. My family off one by one. Let's fight like demons. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? I know you. Legend will be born. All of civilization depends on it. The future. I can see it. I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer. My Lord Duke. Where the fear is gone, only I will remain. Go, go, go! Wow, that was really, really fucking cool. Um, especially, obviously, that that shit that happened in the end with the giant sandworm that everybody knows from Dune. Um, that looks really incredible stuff. And, um, yeah, this looks like it's obviously going to be really, really good. Um, I'm sure everybody who loved uh, Blade Runner 2049 is probably going to end up really loving this film. But, honestly, like as I was watching this, I'm like... 
what's kind of frustrating is that a lot of people who aren't aware of Dune and its history are probably going to watch this in theaters and be like, oh, you know, I like how it got a lot of ideas from Star Wars, when in reality it's actually the opposite. <laughs> but, um, you know, it's it's pretty crazy to finally get a Dune film that looks like, you know, is actually going to be fantastic. Because everybody knows that David Lynch's Dune wasn't very good, and that's definitely because of the Hollywood studios again, um, making it to where just, you know, it, it, you know, where Lynch couldn't actually do what he wanted with the film, and it just turned out really surface level and dumb. But um, this looks really, really incredible. Um, I love just the giant scope of this film, and obviously Villeneuve is a master at being able to create things that like are on a grand scale, but make them really immersive without really doing too much. Like he's, he's, he's really a master at subtle directing that is really impactful. And, um, this just looks incredible guys. I mean, obviously I don't think y'all expected me to say anything different than that, but this looks really, really cool. And, um, I did it say if this was coming out like what does did this give a date? I kind of jumped the gun. Let me see. Rewind this. Dune. I think it just says only in theaters in IMAX. It doesn't have a date, which sucks because that means we still don't know what the hell's going to happen with this film. If they're going to release it at the end of the year or if they're just going to save it till next year, we don't know. Um, I hope that it gets released by the end of the year because I really, really want to see it. But at this point, who knows? Um, probably more than likely not going to happen, unfortunately. But who knows? We might get surprised and we might actually get it. And that would be awesome. That would be really, really cool. But um, yeah, obviously, really, really stoked for this film. If it does come out this year, it'll hopefully, if it lives up to the hype, It'll be my favorite film of the year, but who knows? Sometimes I go into a film um, expecting a lot from it, and it, and it, you know, for some reason, it just falls flat. But Villeneuve has yet to fail, in my opinion. Um, I pretty much love every single film that he's made so far, so I don't think that'll be the case. But either way, um, love the cast for this. Love the way that it's looking so far, and uh, really, really excited to see this. But for those who have seen the trailer already, I would definitely love to hear your thoughts on it, what you think about it. And um, yeah, so I really appreciate you for watching this video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please, please give this video a thumbs up and share it amongst your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to be updated on more film-related content. Yeah.